All righty, we have a panel here that's probably about 30, maybe 35 years old. It's obsolete. They don't make this anymore. It's made by uh, Wadsworth. And what we have here is a uh, 30 amp breaker and there is a 12 gauge wire on the circuit. So that wire breaker is too big for the uh, wire because if you draw 30 amps on number 12 wire, it could overheat the wire and short it out. So I'm going to show you how to swap this out. So first we'll take the cover off the box here. My screwdriver is too long to reach up there, so you know what? I don't have a stubby one, and you know what? I'm going to start the hardware with it. There it is. So this box is a very big mess, so we'll pull our 30 out, turn it off. Let's see if I can pop it out this way. There it is. It has older cloth and rubber wire on it, so we're going to go down here and Alright, so this is a 20-amp oh, yeah. uh, Wadsworth here. I'm just going to make sure it's going to fit in here. That's sheet rock. Yeah. Oh, we got a sheet rock. That goes up to the next one. That goes up to the next one. It's just one thing. Yes, it fits. So we will disconnect our four wire body here. So we're going to shape this wire to go into the uh, breaker here. John, you ain't got no quite wood. None in here. None in her. Okay, check on the other side. That's what. On the other side. I don't want to know you guys to have long to worry. Yeah, I'm going to push up on it so it goes under the screw head here. You know what? I am going to have to pintail that and uh, put a wire nut on it. So we'll bring this wire out. 
And then we're going to put a wire nut on there because it's too short. We'll take our screw out of here like this. Up a little tail here. I put a hole, made our hole to put our wire in, put the screw for the breaker into the hole. We'll put it in our screw terminal here, like this. Put the wire around the screw to direction the screw turns. Okay, uh, tighten it up like that. We'll strip our end the same length as the wire that we're going to splicing onto. Like that. Okay, now we'll take this breaker into the box. Make sure it's back off again, and we will all go up with this wire. And we will pigtail to this wire down here. Make sure our wires are the same length here. Okay, they're the same length. Now I'll get my yellow wire nut. Our, two, our coppers are even on the bottom and our insulation is even at the top. So we'll take our wire nut, we'll just put it in here, we'll just start turning it so that the spring grabs all three, all, both wires. Tighten it up. I'm not going to get too crazy tightening it because I don't want to crumble the insulation on the cloth rubber wires that are back here. Okay, now we can push this back in so it's out of our way and we'll look, make sure our insulation is up into the bottom of the cap, which it is, and now we can uh, put our cover back on the box. Now I didn't put this box in, this was probably put in about maybe uh, 30, 35 years ago. So now we can put our uh, cover back on here. This panel is a really big mess. I'll try putting it in the top.
I'm gonna, now the screw that was down here, I'll put it over here. What is that? I think I need it to line up with me. But you know what? If I can't, I can't. I'm not going to complain and I'm not going to frustrate. There it is. are pinched in here. Make sure our breaker is set in here right. So that is how to uh, replace a Wadsworth breaker in an older panel. This panel is obsolete and I'll show you the Wadsworth logo right there. Peace. Thanks for watching. Here in the country I was born in, we used, uh, we used 14 American wire gauge on 15 amps, 12 American wire gauge on 20 amps, and 10 American wire gauge on 30 amps, even 40, 50 years ago. There is the uh, Wadsworth logo. There is the uh, Wadsworth breaker. They uh, came in uh, 15, 20, and 30 amp for single poles. Alrighty, thanks for watching. That is how to uh, uh, fix a code violation with an oversized breaker in a obsolete uh, panel box. So uh, we had to go online. You can find those uh, Wadsworth breakers online on eBay. And uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Peace again.